एवरीवन एंड वेलकम टू हेल्दी समाधान दिस चैनल इज डेडिकेटेड टू प्रोवाइडिंग इंफॉर्मेशन एंड टिप्स टू हेल्प यू लीड अ मोर बैलेंस्ड हेल्दी एंड फुलफिलिंग लाइफ नेचर हैज प्रोवाइडेड अस विद अ वाइड वैरायटी ऑफ वेजिटेबल्स फ्रूट्स nuts and seeds that can help considerably boost our health as well as strength without the need for ever consuming any artificial supplements so do join us as we give to you healthy samadhans for everyday life problems तो शुरू करें हाई गाइस एंड वेलकम बैक टू हेल्दी समाधान टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस टू वेरी पॉपुलर बेवरेजेस टी एंड कॉफी टी एंड कॉफी आर एन इनसेपरेबल पार्ट ऑफ मोस्ट पीपल्स डाइट्स नाउ डेज But should we be drinking them daily? Which is the better choice? And how much is too much? Let us find out. Tea, popularly known as the cup that cheers, tea is a widely consumed beverage all over the world. All varieties of tea are packed with antioxidants which neutralize free radicals and prevent aging and diseases like cancer. There's green tea and there is black tea. Although green tea consumption is often touted as helpful in weight loss by companies the only actual difference between green tea and black tea is that black tea is fermented while green tea is not and as a result the natural amount of antioxidants is higher in green tea green tea antioxidants are more effective compared to antioxidants found in other foods for example green tea has a compound called egcg which is 87.5 times more effective than vitamin C side effects tea contains a substance called tannin which prevents the absorption of iron in the body making it vulnerable to anemia tea also leads to discoloration of the teeth now let's look at coffee coffee or the cup of joe those who begin drinking coffee never quite give it up and how can they for there is enough research to prove that this delicious beverage which gives you instant energy is mildly addictive in nature however all is not lost for coffee lovers many latest reports of scientists suggest that it too can help in reducing the risk of various types of cancers diabetes and parkinson's disease let's also compare regular coffee with green coffee green coffee is another attempt by companies to replicate the success of green tea Green coffee beans are coffee beans that have not yet been roasted. As a result, green coffee beans contain a higher amount of chlorogenic acid, which is known to have some health benefits. Having said that, coffee consumption is recommended only in moderate quantity owing to the presence of caffeine. Caffeine is a stimulant that robs the bones of calcium while instantly increasing the heart rate and blood pressure. So which is the better choice of the two? and how much is too much you may ask well the good news is that there have been plenty of scientific studies supporting both tea and coffee having health benefits provided they are consumed in moderate quantities which means not more than 4 cups of either in a day at the right time of the day for example it is not recommended having tea or coffee first thing in the morning for both these beverages work best if they are consumed 30 minutes after a meal breakfast or lunch tea and coffee are best avoided after 5 pm as they may disturb your sleep cycle and lastly do keep a check on your sugar serving in them and what you consume with them for often it is not the tea or coffee alone but what you snack with them that is far more unhealthy so have no fear and feel free to grab your favorite beverage I know I will. Hope you found this video useful. Do leave your comments in the section below and don't forget to share 
as well as subscribe. Hi friends, welcome to Healthy Samadhan. Today we are here to bring awareness about the best beverage on this planet. Yes, green tea. Green tea is considered to be one of the world's healthiest drinks and contains highest benefits as compared to any other beverage. It is made from unoxidized leaves and is one of the less processed types of tea. Therefore, it contains the most antioxidants, helpful for our system to work perfectly. Green tea works wonders by boosting our immune system and helping it to fight all kinds of viruses and bacteria and protects us from fever by controlling our body temperature. This is due to the presence of a very important substance called polyphenolic antioxidant. This antioxidant has certain cancer-fighting properties which help to reduce the risk of cancer including lung cancer and that of skin, breast, prostate, cologne, etc. Green tea can help you lose weight to a great extent as it contains bioactive substances, a type of antioxidant that boosts the metabolic rate in short term. It helps reduce body fat, especially in the abdominal area as it is zero calories. Drinking hot green tea twice a day, especially after meals, help us to digest food at a faster rate and flush out all the oils and toxins that we have had throughout the day. It helps to rejuvenate our system for the next day. It contains anti-inflammatory properties and also promises new treatment for skin disorders such as psoriasis and dandruff. The flavonoids present in green tea reduces the risk of chronic diseases like coronary heart disease, stroke, diabetes and also improves the cellular function of tissues as well. It protects the brain from aging. It improves brain function and protects us against Alzheimer's or Parkinson's disease. The original green tea is least oxidized and free of any artificial ingredients. And this is called Camellia sinensis, which would give you the maximum benefits. Well friends, in the coming videos, we shall bring you the best organic brand and an export quality to maximize the benefits of your body. Till next, cheers to green tea.